G'day everybody, it's Gareth from Supertech Electronics and today we're going to remove a CLK320 stereo sound system. Um, first tools you're going to need are a plastic spudger and a Torque 20 screwdriver. Okay, let's get started. This part here is the first part we're going to need to remove. Okay, first thing we're going to do is remove the gear stick out of the way and then we're going to just get our spudger under this and it's held in with clips and there is a little lip here so you need to as you lift it move it forward and then just sit it there just out of the way now these guys here are holding this part in here and to remove that we're going to push our screwdriver in there just you'll see you'll see why we're doing that shortly we're going to do the same to the other side like that and we're going to get that once again, we're just going to put it to the side and get it out of the way. Now that will expose two screws that live up at really weird angles under there. We won't show you on the camera, but once again, they're a Torque 20 screw. They live right up under there. And once you've got that out, those two out, we can... Okay. And we'll put that to the side for the time being. Okay. So the next section we're going to remove is this, is this part here. We've already got ours loose, but uh, heads up, they are on very strong clips. So you'll need to give it a bit of force. And the clips that it's being held in uh, is by these guys here. And you can see that they're, they're fairly strong, strongly wide clips. Alrighty, so once we've got the four screws, this whole stereo will come out. Now, it is held in by some electrical connections. You'll need to remove those. Once again, they're color coded, so you can't get them back in the wrong spot. Well, you can, but they're keyed as well. And once you've got that radio out, you can send it off to Supertech Electronics for repair. 